And oh, what a beautiful day here in South Texas. We certainly deserved it and we got it with a morning low of 51. That's about normal and an afternoon high of 73, about normal there too. No rainfall with our little front that came in this morning and our deficit continues to grow for the year. Now a little bit more than an inch and a quarter. Here's the big weather story. There are no Arctic cold fronts in the forecast and we might have seen the last one period because uh, the time we get a, a strong front in here, the days are going to be too long for us to actually freeze. So we're getting pretty close to the declaration of uh, no freezing temperatures until November. Seasonal 70s all this week for highs. That's good news. More wind and clouds beginning tomorrow and lasting through the rest of the week. I should say Wednesday and lasting through the rest of the week. So again, that's the downside to the forecast. And then there's slim rainfall opportunities all the way through this upcoming weekend. That's the next big weather story for us is that we desperately need <clears throat> rainfall here. Right now in Corpus Christi, we've got clear skies. Again, still nice out there at 65 degrees. East, southeast winds at 14. But notice this. It's 60 in Rockport and 59 in Port Aransas. Very chilly because of the water temperature only being in the 50s. But you go inland and there's a marked difference in the temperatures. It's 76 in Freer and 78 right now in George West. So if you're walking the dog tonight in Corpus Christi, it looks like this. Temperatures will be dropping through the 50s with a light southeast wind putting a floor under our temperatures tonight around 50 degrees but 40s as you go further inland and north. Satellite and radar shows we continue to have clear skies across the region. Beautiful sunshine today. High pressure uh, sitting over the capital city with the chilly air coming in. We'll move off to the east. There's the front that went through this morning dry and uh, the next front will uh, head this way on Thursday but fall apart as it comes into the region. Watch it here. See the high pressure moving off to the east so tomorrow afternoon we get a pretty good uh, sea breeze coming in from the southeast but uh, that'll induce some more clouds here by tomorrow night and Wednesday. You can see it'll be mostly cloudy by then, but tomorrow still a mostly sunny day. Here comes that front on the Pacific Northwest Coast. Notice how the rain falls apart here late Wednesday night and into Thursday as it comes into the region and dissipates. Here are the winds, and again, they look like this across the region. They'll be calm in the morning, a light breeze tomorrow afternoon, good marine conditions, southeasterly winds 6 to 12 knots. As far as uh, what's happening with the uh, low temperatures tonight, 48 degrees here, but all the way down to 40 in Beeville and 55 in Port Aransas. And the highs tomorrow reach 77 here, but only 66 in Port Aransas and 80 further inland. And the seven day forecast has more clouds and seasonal temperatures. We reach 79 Wednesday, just a few little showers here uh, Thursday into Friday, but nothing significant and uh, the uh, warm temperatures continue all the way through Monday of next week.